it's actually lasting a pretty impressive time. Then again, I think these are the guys with the armor, I'm not sure. You join up with the first fleet. And we'll go see if any of our bombers are actually ready. I don't think any of them are yet. Well, there's one. So this should be pretty fun to see, I must say. It's got 12,000 shielding, so this guy shouldn't really, it shouldn't actually hurt us all that much. I think I go to this one first, because that has a lot of uh, technology research on it. Oh god, my freaking leads in the way on my mic. Let's have a look. No, that's not the one we're after. Which is the one that I was telling to make just plain soldiers? Was it on this one? Yeah. I got no more monies. I want to build it. I don't care. <laughs> oh, this should be hopefully be enough. Okay. We got a fair few there, I must say. Oh, he's going all the way up there, probably to back up that system. But we want this guy to come over here because he needs to destroy shit. I get a judge. Uh, you might want to retreat, buddy. Because you're just getting hammered. What do they have? Do they have like EMP launchers? Gun emplacements fire center flat crowns. Iron cat. Yeah, the iron defense cannon is extremely effective. Planetary defensive weaponry fires. That can both damage and disable target ships. Antimatter unlocked. That's good. I wonder if I tell all my ships to attack it. Would it make any difference? Surely some of them must have something. Okay, the bombers are actually... Oh, Jesus, what's this? Everyone go! Bombard the fucking ion shield. As soon as that other guy gets here, this will be GG, and here he comes. He's just gonna fire 20 quadrillion bombs at this freaking planet. Go, 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 go! <laughs> I wanna see this happen. Okay. Drop your damn bombs. Oh, look at all of them. Oh, that's awesome. I don't think this runs out of... How much does it actually use? It only uses up like 50 per turn and this guy is getting hammered. Oh, look at all of it. That's awesome. Yeah, our frontal ships here are taking quite the beating. He might want to retreat before I lose him. That's a lot of stuff to actually... Oh, no, no, retreat. Why does everyone stop bombarding it? Bombard it! Bombard the freaking iron cannon. Could I take him on? I think I could. They're relatively weaker. Oh wow, that just freaking destroyed all of it. And then we're gonna... Troops, Landau. And that's just gonna be a freaking massacre. <laughs> just wiped out everything in one stroke. An event requires your attention. We have successfully conquered our first Quarterzine world. The Quarterzine are an odd race of completely 
immobile mollusk like creatures. We have a hard outer shell and a single large sensory organ. The quadrocene have developed complex phenomenal emitters that allow them to manipulate the native creatures on their home planet. The quadrocene have a symb symbiotic relationship with species called Alwoks, who were enslaved by the quadrocene phenomenons. With the death of so many quadrocene in our invasion, many Oloks are awakening from their drug fuel slavery and hailing us as liberators. One particular work approaches our troops, it is gnarled and greying with age, its, its wide eyes clouded with cataracts. Thank you, Liberators, for freeing us from the masters. From the masters, quack know this. That while we were slaves, we <coughs> all know we are slaves. We all yearn for our freedom. If you can free us from the masters' drugs, then we will join you. Fight for you, quack. Come with us. Let us show you how they enslave us. Perhaps you can discover a way to free us all. Right. So that means there's a new research option available. Which should probably be in secrets. Yeah. This device will spread a fast acting antidote to the mind control serum by used by the causing to enslave the oil. So if we get this then we can equip this onto one of our like say one of our bombers and then they'll um, drop that on a planet and they'll be all free I want that to import action oh my Jesus oh, I can't actually oh god damn it governor alright governor there we go We actually do want to have something on this. There you go. Well, I'll make it quite quickly then, at least. So now it's time for this guy, which has just about the same amount of equipment on it. I wish there was an easier way just to lift all these up off the ground, but I think this is the easiest way that I know of. Your second fleet you can wait there. Where's our big daddy? Where is he? I need him. Where's our freaking um, bomber? Is he, is he already there? Yeah, he's already, he's already fucking bombing away. We actually have more of these guys don't we now I hope so anyway no oh no that's fuck I keep on going on with that one I don't know why it's this one no we don't actually oh no we oh no it was just made <laughs> right so now we also need you over by these guys we'll take over this last plant and then I'll stop the recording here guys we've been recording for a fair while now Yeah, these guys are just getting pulverized. So we can probably land there now. Before this guy completely obliterates it all. <laughs> That's what he's doing anyway. He doesn't give a fuck. Right, and we'll land all troops. This should be over pretty quickly. There we go. Easy as that. <laughs> it's just as easy as that now, just to take over a planet. Which is always nice. So we have a ton of food resources and of course this guy is still fucking manual. I want manual. I like to be in control of my shit. Right, this one needs a rover bay drastically to improve the... because I think this is mainly a fertility planet here. So all this is going to take a while to build but um, well, at it can have that, that and that just to improve its defenses so uh, yeah we successfully taken over two planets guys uh, it's worthwhile we've made some few ships a few more ships uh, a few cruisers few frigates a few specialized people things next one will be Iglum Iglum 1 it is a rich Terran and it has nothing on it so that would be 
pretty damn simple to take over anyway. I think the hardest one will be actually up here because this is where they originate from. And as you can see, they got like a big fucking evasion fleet right here with all kind of nasty stuff on it. And we'll have to deal with them. Oh, for God's sake. I want to stop and you autosave. Yeah. Come on. Right, there you go. But yeah, thank you guys for joining me. Uh, we'll completely wipe out most likely all of these guys in the next episode since we have all of our stuff ready. Thank you for joining me and have a good day. Make sure also make sure you comment, rate, subscribe and like. Like the shit out of it because if you like it I make more. And if you like it it makes me happy. And we all want to make Tony happy, don't we? Yeah we do. Everyone wants to make Tony happy. It's just a simple way of life. So thank you guys for joining me. I will see you next time. Bye!